I'm Melinda Meow, producer of the Volt Report. Here to keep you guys updated on the current Volt Show. Today we're live at Cherry Park. It's a very uh, widely known skate park, as you can see. Click the link and see what I'm talking about. Anyways, let's get right into this week's technology. The Hyperloop Transport is getting gnarly. Leading engineers have been announced. Marco Villa and Patricia Galloway are taking on crowdsourcing campaigns and that will develop the Hyperloop Transport. The 700 miles per hour transport. Tube to be. Tech Cube is so necessary for pet owners. It's a small cube that has a camera, microphone, speakers, and it provides smartphone communication with your pet. While you're away, for play there is a laser pointer. So how cute is that? Ping pong is evolving into a new game with beat match table. Every time the ball makes contact with the table, it makes musical notes. And if that isn't cool enough, patterns and designs illuminate the tabletop. That's pretty freaking awesome. Ding, 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 ding. And other folding car news, a new transformer car is on the road. Look for the compact car, Hiriko, that'll be on the market in the not too distant future. Look for it in GTA 6. Researchers of MIT are making ion engines. These engines can lift airplanes. The ion thrusters are energy efficient, zero emissions, and can be more powerful than today's jet engine. Does that sound cool to you? Let us know if that sounds cool in the comments below. That's it from the Volt Report last week. Stay tuned this week for more goods by subscribing below. Thanks for keeping current with the Volt Report and Godspeed. Back to Ohio we go with these ions. Wait, they're not they're not here yet, but soon we'll be able to travel with these ions. Ion, ion engines on a supersonic jet or maybe even the Hyperloop. We'll take the Hyperloop back to Ohio. So Imagine, imagine that. Do you think Japan will go super Wi-Fi in time to stream the Olympic Games? <laughs> <sighs>